I hope you guys are fucking ready for Guilty Gear XR Revelator. Because uh, I barely am. I actually, personally, have never played Revelator myself. This is going to be all new to me. I only tangentially know the story. Like, not, not even tangent. I, I know fragments of what people have told me about it. So I'm, I'm, I am super excited for this. I even, like... So, for Golden Week, uh, Rev 2 was on sale for, like, a crazy fucking discount, and I already own Revelator. Uh, and, like, specifically, Rev 2 was on discount, the upgrade from Revelator wasn't. So, I, I bought the whole new, different game, just because I was so excited. Also, I have six streams to beat this, because we are going into Strive on launch day. Uh, we're also going to have a Friday stream, I want to say, next week. Because uh, there's going to be another beta test for Guilty Gear Strive. God, you guys have no idea how excited I am for more Guilty Gear. Uh, another thing I'm going to do is boop up the uh, audio for the game, because we got to watch this opening movie. So that we know what's going on. Also, geez, I am like... Why am I in, like, a corner? Come on, camera, behave. There we go. Alright, we just gotta wait this out so that we can see the opening. What's happening? Okay, I don't think that there's any story to this. But we get to listen to Break a Spell, so I'm happy. So, uh, slight downside to Revelator. They, uh, they didn't get the English voice cast back. So, you don't get Sojiro Sakura as Leo White Fang. Sadly. Uh, but luckily, uh, from what I've heard, they got them back for Guilty Gear Strive. Uh, also, there are going to be a bunch of characters that you have no idea who they are in this. Such as Jam. Uh, probably Answer, though we saw him, kind of. Uh, Kum Hai Hyun. By Ken's grave. All right, let's get pumped up. All right. So I think it's the same as last time, uh, as far as my guide says, where the arcade modes take place during the time between the end of Sign and this game. So, uh, yeah, let's do episode. Uh, we're only gonna go one round, because I don't want to have to do it twice. Uh, computer level normal, no input latency. God, this is such an improvement. And the first episode that we need to do is our girl Elfelt. Uh, we're going technical, because I get fucked up with stylish. I did a quick test for this game, just to be sure, but... So yeah, last time on Guilty Gear, Elfelt got kidnapped by the Universal Will just as she regained her emotions. And luckily, we don't get the evil cancel of evil this time around. We just, we just get Saint Maximus.
What? Oh god damn it. <laughs> okay, we might be we might be having a chair stream cuz my my battery level is dying. Uh, hold up guys. We're we're going We're going different this time around. gonna be weird guys but we're, we're doing it like this this time around just until the uh, controller can regain its mojo Oh, jeez. So as you can see, Elfelt is uh, all about guns and roses. Get it? Get it? Because that's a, that's a music reference, just like Guilty Gear. I have no idea how to do Elfelt, but uh, we'll figure that out. She may be my favorite character. Uh, of the Valentines, but I have no idea how to play as her. Alright, we're just gonna... We're gonna insta-kill our good friend Ram. And now she's in love with us! Isn't that wonderful? Oh god, it looks like uh, my microphone might be catching some of that good old... God damn it. PlayStation fan. God, this is super shitty. I will make sure that my controller is charged next time. I'm sorry, guys. Oh yeah, you guys uh, only know Dizzy from... the ending of story mode. So those were her wings. Uh, Undine and Necro. God, aerial raves make me so much better. Okay, we got it. We're gonna make everyone love us. <laughs> and yet, yes, Dizzy in fact has a son and a loving husband. No, I love you, El.
Oh, I was kicking that grenade for too long. Come on. Magnum wedding. Alrighty now. <laughs> oh, jeez. That's a bit forward, Elfelt. Hey, we know Zato. Let's make Zato love us. You will love us. Oh, I was way off aim for that one. Let's see if we can make Zato love us. Yes, we can! Yep, every time Alpha wins, she's gonna talk about uh, their new life together. Why is the computer level easy? I thought I set it to normal. So Jam's story is that, uh, back in Guilty Gear XX, uh, she wanted to make a restaurant, and the government was offering, like, a ton of world dollars in order to capture Dizzy, the, uh, girl from the four with the two wings. And, uh, according to canon, she claimed that she, uh, kicked Dizzy's ass, uh, so she got the money. And she got to open up her restaurant, she was super happy. And it looks as though uh, she's gonna, she's had to start over. Oh, jeez. And now she's kicking my face in. I want off this ride. Oh, no! We can't make Jam love us! If she won't love us. And she has to die. Oh, just blat blat to the face, I guess. That's how we're doing this. She died of a nosebleed. Alright, I guess Jan's our marriage rival. 
go her. All right, so yeah, Leo's playable now. If I'm playing as her, I really like Elfeld's guns. <laughs> Makes me really wish that I got her in Epic 7. Okay, well. Leo's getting... Leo's getting shot. He doesn't get to love me. So he dies. Oh, I might die, actually. There we go. Elfeld's kind of overthinking things. I think maybe she's been reading too many romance books. Okay, I guess we're marrying Saul bad guy. Honestly, not the worst fit. Uh, Soul specifically said barbecue. Lots going on here. Okay, this this is going to need a woman's touch. Let's make Soul Bad Guy fall for us. Oh jeez, I am keeping the audio super hard. <laughs> Here. This might make things uh here. Let's see if this works. No. When Soul Bad Guy wants to marry someone. Oh, 
君は誰にでも素直に好意を寄せられるのに実は自ら遠ざけているきっとこのやり方では君を傷つけてしまうだけだあの感情が芝居じゃねえって言うならうるさいなあはいサウスやれやれこれではいけないなあなたは確かあなたがラムの敵でだから私の敵でやめた方がいい下手にこの夢から覚めるようなことになれば君は必ず後悔する残されたわずかな時間自らを呪って過ごすことになるいいかい僕はこの夢の中ならば君の願いを何でも叶えてあげられるんだだからもっと有意義なことを望んでくれ、uh, to wake up, please. だったらそれはあなたを倒して自由になることです Damn straight Heaven or hell Do a Do a one Let's rock Uh, kind of dropping the ball there. Alright, l well, I guess that man's gonna fall in love with me. But it's gonna be entirely u n r e p l a c e a b l e だからこそ言っておくよ。僕たちのためにありがとう。思い出した。私は、私は、ジャスティスになる。Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Also, this is like a completely different vibe from、uh, Lily. This is、uh, a lot more funky. I kind of prefer Lily to be completely honest. You know, if I'm going to be here, I don't need to keep my stream manager up. I can just do that on the、uh, other screen over there. It's been a long time since I've streamed from this desk. The last time I streamed from the desk was like. God. I think it was back during. It would have to be back during Kate's Day Night, yeah.
There we go. Good old Beanpot Corporation. And the, man, the Success Corporation, yeah. If I was gonna name my thing, like my, my company, calling it the Success Corporation would be a pretty good sell. kind of a bop. I, I will admit, this music's pretty, like, buffing. Oh! Epic Games Japan. I guess, yeah, since this runs Unreal. And then Sega would probably be the arcade stuff. Yeah, it runs Unreal. Let's check the battery status. No, it's still really shitty. And fortunately, my battery pack is USB-C to USB-C, so that wouldn't work. Hey, I almost had a score of a million. Over. Game over! Alright, I got a few world dollars. Uh, so what's neat is, uh, I can go fishing. For figures. Fishing. So, let's take some of our world dollars and go fishing. Oh, I got, like, a, a little cute boy. I think this is the online lobby, so. Uh. Fuck it, let's, let's edit the avatar. Okay, I can't, I can't edit the app. Can I? No. Okay, let's go fishing. I've got... enough for a tenfold. Sure, let, let's do this gotcha. What did I get? I got Leo as my face. Uh... Temkin, color, illustration, guild icon, Zato figure, as well as Bedman answer. Hikaru Midorikawa? I don't know who that is. Uh, I got a new color for Kaido, which is neat. Uh, don't have enough world dollars for another tenfold. So, uh, yeah, I guess after each arcade mode, we'll just, uh, go and pull for stuff. Story. Sit back, enjoy the game story. Default settings. Alright. Let's start the story. I'll just put the controller down for this one. Oh yeah, so here's a little recap for Guilty Gear. Uh, so yeah, basically the energy crisis is just gone, and then they decide to fuck everything up because war. Justice so this all happened before the first Guilty Gear. By the literal Hundred Years War. Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-Twenty-
Oh, I guess we're just uh, skipping straight to Valentine. Oh, So yeah, la last time on our stream, we did this. Oh, yeah, yeah! あれの正体も目的も判明していない。ゆりかごです。教えてよ。これから何が起きるか知っているんでしょ。答えはラムと話してみちゃう。ダメかな。国会の北側です。何かが出現します。間違いありません。ゆりかごです。補填一旦ブ
さと取り返しに行くぞ。こいつは奪われてたまんか。Damn straight. Now here's chapter one. セレキ2187年世界は未知なる存在慈悲なき刑事から度重なる襲撃を受けていたそのすべての危機を辛くも乗り越えてきた人類そうした戦いの歴史に終止符を打つべく最後の時を迎えようとしていた I mean yeah it's just the new goal of the world アリエス西欧芸家のお言葉を So, this is like just off the trails of、uh, the last game. This was literally the last cutscene from Xart Sign's story mode. Lady, your hat's stupid. Looks like Marie Antoinette's hat from Fade. I hate to tell you, Saint Maximus, but you are not my homie. しかし、足元を見てください。我々が踏みしめているこの地です。大いなる意志が今の我々を支えています。何世紀もかけて気づかれた。Well admit though, her lipstick is on point. 聞こえるはずです。正しくあれ。She's got a sick sword, too. Meanwhile, I think you've been a bitch. I was excited to meet my mom until I realized that she fucking sucked. The face animations are way better in this version. Holy shit. Justice, 
質問ばかりだなラムレザルには適性がなかっただけだおかげで随分と邪魔な存在になってしまったそろそろ殺すかまだ、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょなるほど。Welcome to Scenic, my computer chair, because I let my controller run out of battery. Dog is being really vocal today. That's an interesting idea having like spiritual hackers. As though magic is like the world's programming. Like to just be able to whip out your laptop and hack into a ghost. That would be crazy. I, I love that idea. Oh, man. I think I might incorporate that idea into、uh, the campaign setting that I'm writing. I was working on the Arena fan cam. Difficulty finding a fitting clip for Everything Goes My Way. Everyone knows my name. Seems Arena either does stupid stuff or have horrendous stuff happen. Yeah, I mean. I, I guess the best way to do it would be、uh, going into her backstory episode and taking some stuff from when she was a kid. Because, like, she had a happy childhood. You know, Arena had loving parents who were successful in their careers and she was. Supported in her pursuit of fashion, so everything was specifically going her way.、Uh, as for everyone knows my name, that one's a bit harder because, you know, that, that's the end goal. Kind of、uh, trying to keep it modern? Ah, fair enough. I mean, I guess maybe the fight with Buclair? Where、uh, she's standing in front of everyone, victorious, before she throws the corpse into the,、uh, into the crowd. That's a scary ghost. I'd be afraid of the earthquake ghost, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, the, the high point in Arena's life right now is killing Buclair and taking back Kylandria.、Uh, <laughs> very rare for her to have a high point. Celebratory corpse eating? Absolutely! That's how Arena do. How's it going, Paragamer? Nice to see you for the Guilty Gear stream. 
テゴリー3程度で地震が起きたとしたらそれは女王対フレアがものすごい規模だったってことだよ<笑>すごいぞランディこんな現象千年に一度あるかないかだよ僕たちは今歴史的な出来事の目撃者になったんだ You know, now that I think about it, I designed Arena to just throw stuff. And she... She threw a lot of different things. She threw steel balls, she, th she threw Kinora, she threw a berry, she threw a corpse. She's just the queen of Yeet. The Yeet of Supremus. Welcome to the opening credits of the Guilty Gear Revelator movie. Welcome to Illyria. I would fucking love to have, like, an action RPG set in Guilty Gear. Like, just going down the streets of Illyria, which don't look like they're properly planned. <laughs> Lined up a bunch of well-timed frames to the beat. Aw, oh, man. I'm super excited to see it, Pepper Shaker. It's still, like, a weird feeling that people make fan works of my character, you know? <laughs> I, ma I made a Maho Jojo. I, I didn't think anything would come of that. <laughs> like, look at this war room. I'd love to explore it. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you enjoy them, Paragamer. That's the whole reason I do them, just to hang out with people and bring some entertainment. Holy fuck, dude. Well, hey, I mean, if you post it, then, uh, link me in Discord or, uh, tag me on Twitter. I'll, uh, show it during the stream. I'm still not convinced that, uh, that man is specifically evil. I think that he's being a huge dick, but I wouldn't say that he's evil. The words may have some copyright or whatnot? Nah, it's fine. I'm a small enough channel where I don't think uh, they have the copyright spies on me. And besides, Guilty Gear is filled with a whole bunch of copyrighted music, so if I haven't been hit for this, then I should be good. Vernon, are you going to be an asshole and, like, turn the might of the United States of America against all bad guy? ああ、しかし間違っても本人には直接聞かないことです。何をだ。彼の過去です。何でも好きが落ちる。好き。戦場における人屈というやつか。君は信頼しているか? Oh man. Those magic cell phones that, like, you, you just put a finger up to your ear and a spell happens. 
god, I love that idea. That's another idea I might incorporate into my campaign setting, holy shit. God, they must have given Ishiwatari-san just a much higher budget for Revelator. Alright, how's the, uh... No, I don't have enough battery to go back to the couch. We've still got an hour left of the stream, at least. Alright, uh, let's go back to Arcade. Uh, that looks good. Whose episode is next? So we just did Elfeld. Oh god damn it, today was Cinco de Mayo. Should've made tacos tonight. Or like, actually put the effort in to make tamales. Um. Oh, that's right, Resident Evil came out too. God, I need to pick that up. There's a lot of stuff that I need to grab. Uh, Dizzy. Oh, hey, Dizzy's stuff all happens in one day, so that's gonna be super easy to follow. Alright, we're doing Dizzy's story mode. I don't know how to play as Dizzy. Uh, I haven't made tacos, but I had no clue it was Cinco de Mayo. Yeah! Taking notice that your local comic book store is selling the new issue of Ultraman? Oh man. Yeah, I used to have a pull box myself, and one time I let go for like a couple weeks, and I had like $200 worth of comics to, uh, to grab. So I, I completely get ya. That was actually part of the reason I stopped buying comics. Because they get expensive. And yeah, uh, Ultraman's really, really cool. I, I just personally can't get into it myself. But, uh, hey, I really hope that you're enjoying Tokushotsu, like... You know, they had 1971 Kamen Rider on when, uh, I sent everyone over. They had, a uh, Super Sentai on yesterday, I think. I don't know what they have on today, but... You know, we might send... We might go their way unless, like, one of my friends is streaming. Well, Kai, they have a pill for that. You know, I know that they're using a PNG for that fire, but it is a... Well, I guess a GIF for that fire, but it is a good GIF. Alright, let's kill Faust. Oh, hey! So this was... This is a flashback to Guilty Gear XX. Dizzy literally just wants to live. <laughs> Well, 
未知のものを恐れているだけです Alright, fuck you, Faust. Okay, so... It looks like maybe Dizzy is a really technical character. <laughs> Uh, this is not my playstyle at all. Okay, we are activating instant kill mode. That was a very cautious win. I <laughs> did not want to die. Alright, let's kill Mac. Ah, uh, her theme song's so good. So we only have six streams to beat Revelator. Uh, Guilty Gear Strive comes out on June 11th, and we're going to be streaming it, I mean, if not that night, then uh, like as soon as possible. Also, found out a little tidbit about our boy Soul Bad Guy. Uh, so he has a last name. Uh, if if you forgot, his first name is Frederick, uh, aka Freddy. What do you think his uh, last name is? If the answer was Bulsara, literally Freddie Mercury's last name, uh, like legally, you'd be correct. His name is Frederick Bulsara. So yeah, Pepper Shaker, you were close. I like how it advertises that I set the AI to easy. <laughs> oh, there's Venom. I mean, I'm professional at not being good at this. At some point, we need to play Pokémon on stream. Just so that I can prove that there's a fighting game that I'm good at. <laughs> Mind you, I haven't played Pokémon in forever, so... That may have changed. Sure, do include the careless whisper uh, clip? Absolutely. God, when when Dingo included that, that was that was mm, that was perfect. No oh, shit. You made that quick pepper shaker, good on ya. Also, I guess uh, some lore for Dizzy is that, uh, you know that giant Evangelion that we fought in the last game? That, you know, Saul punched? That's Dizzy's mom. <laughs> and this is Johnny. May has a crush on him. Even though he literally wears like the uh, the fedora trench coat combo, 
started six hours ago and been completing it incrementally. Hey, I mean, good on ya. I mean, my workflow is bad, because uh, I basically ignore a project most of the week and then set aside, like, you know, 8 to 16 hours and just work on it non-stop. Oh, jeez. Okay, guess we're not doing the instant kill on Johnny. We are gonna go for the cautious victory. Oh hey, I won that one. Nice. Just over a minute, made up of clips from Fool's Gold, so it's only basic editing. But still, do you think you did well? Yeah, absolutely. I'm sure you did. No. In this house, we stand dizzy. And Ramlethal. And Elfel. And by Ken. And Jam. I mean, in, in this house, we stand all the Guilty Gear characters besides Bedman. Speaking of which, hi, Bedman. This man can uh, sleep on the bed of Legos. Wow, I have not even dented bed, man. Okay, let, let's see what like standard inputs give me. God, there's so many logos! Okay. It feels like I should only get close if there's like... Okay, never mind. We are... We are in full rushdown mode. Just, just gonna do a little eh, eh, eh. Oh no, it exported weird. No, oh, I know, I know that feeling. One time I had to export uh, an animation that I made, and it kind of cut out and blurred the frames together in the middle of it. But it was a horror animation, so it kind of worked out. mic sensitivity down because the pipes are going and in this configuration that's kind of bad Super move that I can do. I can't complete it. Oh man. That's interesting. That's cute. Uh, what do we got for Dizzy? Ooh, Gamma Ray. That is complicated. Um, forward, backward, forwards. Then round back. Gosh, 
god, I, I feel like maybe I need to like... Alright, you know what? I am in no mood, Chip. Ah, no worries, Pepper Shaker. Answer being another character that you guys didn't get to see in uh, Exard Sun. Aside from being like Chip's assistant.誰かを傷つける覚悟なのですかその問いは難しいです。答えを一つに絞り込むには人は幼すぎる。しかし、これだけはわかります。誰も傷つけない世界があったとしても、人が傷つかない世界はありません。いえ、その傷を背負わない世
Yeah, so I'm gonna use my power to kill my husband. Hip thrown by his ponytail. Exactly. I'm gonna just use my instant kill against him. Uh, he's not going to die. Since we missed, but uh, his ponytail is gonna go away and he's gonna surrender. <laughs> There we go. We we beat it without killing him. Still don't think that line translated very well. Victory through fear. Huzzah! I mean, coming from a Dungeons & Dragons perspective, if I can end the confrontation through intimidation alone, then I consider that an, a greater win. But maybe that's because, unlike a lot of D&D players, charisma is not my dub stat. The party will always need a face. It's because the only one that easily allows you to put YouTube videos right in it. You may take the finished clip, mute it, and put it over the music in another software. I was actually going to suggest that, but I was kind of sure that you would have thought about that. So, I, I think that's the best way to go around it. As usual, we are never skipping the uh, end credits for arcade mode because the music in this game is just too good. I also swapped out the uh, opening theme and the uh, ending theme for the stream with Guilty Gear music for this one, so. I, I did music from Sign last time and now I'm doing music from Revelator, so. Man, Naoki Hashimoto is just so good at vocals, he had to be all caps. Meanwhile, Makoto, he's so humble that he's in all lowercase. Kind of, you know, balance each other out. Man, I am so excited for this new microphone that's uh, on its way, hopefully. Uh, it hasn't shipped yet. I think maybe they were out of stock, but still put it on sale. But uh, I was going to just cancel the order and order one that was in stock, but this one has, uh, like, live monitoring. So I can, like, plug some headphones straight into the microphone, and I can listen to my audio that I'm producing in real time as opposed to with any latency. So it, it's fantastic. I, I'm definitely alright with waiting for it. I'm, I'm gonna re-record I'm gonna actually, like, straight up wait to record the Guilty Gear cover album until I get this new microphone. Because I'm sure that, uh... Like, with the monitoring alone, the quality's gonna go up. Party always needs a face. 
We all know that it ain't gonna be gothy, exactly. It's because she's, uh... I, I mean, if, if you give her a Sharpie, she can be the face of the party. <laughs> oh man, I, I have a drawing somewhere, I think it's on my uh, old laptop, where I drew Beach Gothy. Uh, and she... It, it was in my I want to draw people with, uh, with sunglasses phase. So I didn't know how to draw Gothy with sunglasses, so I had her, like, scribble them on. It's really cute. Uh, I said this before, but Arena is sort of like the Sokka of the group. I can see that, absolutely. I hope I hope Abby doesn't turn into the moon, though. That would be kind of awkward. But no, like, she... She's the emotional heart of the group, in my opinion. Like, for all the angst that Sips has, and all the tragedy and bluntness that Gothi has. Irina just sort of brings the human aspect to it. Which, uh, actually, fun fool's gold fact. Uh, I will reveal to you on this stream, on the first Guilty Gear Revelator stream, uh, not Irina's class, but her, uh, race. And I actually didn't play her as a human or an elf or anything. It was a uh, race called the Rilkin, which are, like, these not-quite-lizard-folk. Like, they, they just sort of have patches of scales. Uh, but they have, like... They have this perk that increases their dexterity and charisma, uh, but also have this thing called racial knowledge, where they can use any knowledge stat uh, as, uh, as though they had, like, one rank in it. So, like, if you want to use, like, Knowledge Local, but you don't have it, you can still use it. Oh, sorry, give me one sec. Alright. Oh, wait, I accidentally fished for one. Let's, let's go with ten. Did I get anything cool? I got character colors, digital figures, a fresh half beak. Um, I think we can get something cooler. See, I'm absolutely cool with a gotcha aspect as long as it doesn't use real money, you know? <laughs> I fished for one again, jeez. See if I can make our avatar look okay. Alright, well, I guess we're... Why, why isn't it letting me be Leo? There we go. God, this face looks stupid. I love it. Ah, oh, come on. There we go. How's the, uh, controller's battery looking? Okay, we got enough battery to move back to the couch. Alright, give me one sec, guys. And, of course, I've wrapped the, uh, power cord around my chair. Gonna be honest, was not the biggest fan of impromptu couch stream. I don't think we're going to be doing that unless I plan for it in the future. No, I need this to be all the way. And this one goes down. Uh, am I leaving anything behind? Nope. Ah, uh, nope, but I did forget something. Ugh. 
There we go. Ah, oh, man. That is way more comfortable. I don't have the greatest computer chair right now. Oh, I hate when that happens, Pepper Shaker. God, just how much strikes again. I mean, hey. Who can draw a ten pole and get SSRs? Get the banner character and it will make it ours. The gotcha man. The gotcha man can, cause he sprinkles it with money and draws all the good stuff. Man, I am alright with, uh, improvising, like, words, but having me improvise a song is kinda difficult. If I'm being completely honest. Well, hey, I'm excited to see a pepper shaker. Hey, we're, we're all right with saying the, the fuck word. It's cool, Sen. I still can't get over how great Dr. Paradigm's, like, lizard professor design is, like, He's a little dragon that's teaching science. He's great. まあ、だが人間社会に来てからは食べ物が変わりすぎた。胃薬が欠かせなくなったのは辛いかな。どうするつもりだ。<笑> Incidentally, like, Saul, Dizzy, Dr. Paradigm, they're all, like, outliers in terms of Gears. Because Gears don't actually have any sentience, usually. Uh, but with them, like, they, they're, they like, fully cognizant. Well, I guess they're, they're sentient, but they're not sapient, you know? Because gears are driven by instinct, and then they're controlled by justice, but then they're the sapient ones that can act on their own. It's, it's different. Mark my words, I'm going to figure out how to mechanically make these magic cell phones in uh in my three, like in my D and D campaign. I'm thinking that I'm gonna have it just be just a handy version of the message spell. But, like, I'd nerf it a bit so that anyone within, like, ten feet can hear you. Like, both sides of the conversation. Okay, I don't listen to St. Maximus. As a person outside of the uh, game, I know that she's full of shit.
元老院が秘密裏に行っていたことですどうかご自分をお責めにならないでください分かっているとは思いますが Is a mirror is the camera shaking? There's like this weird shake going on. Kareda you see it too? Good, so it, it definitely wasn't me. I don't even know how you could accidentally do it if they... Because you'd have to, like, actually shake the camera that you've done. If, like, if this were Maya, at least. Yeah, for sure, Pepper Shaker. I just hope it works out for you, buddy. もったいないお言葉。しかし、そうですね。強いて見返りを求めるには、もうじき縮小会に開かれます。今年はちゃんと出席しなさい。縮小会ですか。しかし、このような時期に、このような時期だからです。生成に勝利した日は、人類が新た
so yeah, there's a there's a third Valentine that we have to deal with. Her name is Jacko. Jacko Valentine. Oh, you can absolutely give it a goddammit arena. Arena is absolutely here to cause trouble for absolutely everyone, including people outside of the uh, Bellowing Wilds. Ah, uh, thank you for popping by, Paragamer. Have a good rest. And I hope you do well in whatever you have to wake up early for. Alright, what's the next arcade mode that we have to go through? Now that I'm not spending like 20 minutes on each arcade mode because of the difficulty and the amount of rounds, it's uh, going by really quickly. Whoops. Alright, so now we have to do Kai. And lucky for me, I know how to play as Kai Kisk. Uh, there's Kai. Actually. Give me a second, I'm gonna take a look at a couple of the other characters. I want to see if there's, a uh, one specific guy. Temkin, Axel... No, he might not be here unless, uh... He's, like, the unlockable guy down there. But I think that's... No, that would be the random... No, the random button's over here. So maybe he's there. Uh, so there's a joke character. Uh, it's Robo Kai. He's he's Kai Kisk, but a robot. Jinryは二度目のバレンタイン襲来を辛く虫に続けた。しかし事件は終結したわけではない。第一伝王カイキスクは事の真相を探るべく調査を開始した。帰国にもぜひ捜査に協力していただきたい。ありがとうございます。では現地で合流しましょう。これが最善の策とは思えませんが、しかし最善の結果を期待できます。それにしても対バレンタインの特攻兵器である。Oh shit. Okay, well. Here, what we're going to do, Pepper Shaker, uh, I was I was trying to pause so that we could watch your uh, video, but what we're going to do is uh, go back here. We'll restart the arcade mode because I hadn't touched it. And uh, let's go take a look at the arena fan cam. Uh, give me one sec. Gotta turn off that. Turn on desktop audio. Find my way to Twitter. Uh, display capture, where are you? 
There we go. Just did a bad thing. I regret the thing I did. And you're wondering what it is. Tell you what I did. I did a bad thing. I'm having a bad day. Here. It's turning into a bad year. That's better. Ah, oh, that's perfect. Thank you so much, Pepper Shaker. Uh, I just gotta... God, get this to the right size, please. I think that's how it's supposed to be. Uh, of course, gotta like and retweet. There we go. Thank you so much again, Pepper Shaker. It's perfect. Uh, what desktop audio? Off. Game audio. On. There we go. Ah. Alright, now let's, let's take a look at what Kai's up to. I don't think he's going to be doing a bad thing like Arena has the entire campaign. God, that was also like the best song you could have picked. That is some armor ass armor, holy shit. Look at those shoulders. Those are like some Warhammer Space Marine shoulders. And he has jetpacks. Okay, could you tell us which nation it is? Is it is it the US? Because I'm going to be real, I don't quite trust President Vernon. Alright, let's kick Jam's ass. Bitch, I'm the king of Illyria. She just walked under my, uh, beautiful attack. Wait, was that... Was that a number? 
I kept seeing the number five pop up. Oh, Jam, don't, please! No! That's gonna hurt. Oh, that hurt. Oh, I, I had thought that I was way too far away for that. Kai, uh, I mean, this is a fight. I don't think he should be worried about where to look. Oh, and now we're gonna... <laughs> now Kai's gonna beat his wife. in the hang of Kai. Rest in peace, Jesse. Jeez. Kai, that's the woman that you married. <laughs> I know she can handle it. She's really fucking powerful, but like... Out of courtesy, maybe don't kick her ass. Now, Ino, on the other hand, I am perfectly comfortable with kicking her ass. She's kind of... She's, she is a huge asshole. And also, she was a really, really difficult fight in Guilty Gear XX. Fighting Guilty Gear XX was a was a bullet hell. Abs absolutely, like. Now that you picked up guitar, you're gonna try to suss out the mel. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, knowing Ishiwatari, like he would have picked a specific model for that guitar to be. It's kind of interesting. My brother plays guitar as well. And I picked up piano and singing, so like... If I want to, I could hit him up and we could like collaborate on a song together. I just don't know what kind of song he would want to play guitar on. I, I doubt he'd be into participating in the, uh... There we go. Into participating in the Guilty Gear cover-up. 
Looks like a Telecaster. Okay. I'll admit, the only guitar model that I know is like a Stratocaster. And that's because that's like... I, I think the Stratocaster Jr. was the one that uh, Rocksmith came with when I used to sell video games. Later, Axel. Currently playing a strat. It's a mini-sized Squire strat, but it plays like a strat nonetheless. Okay, that's cool. I'm playing a Casio keyboard. Actually, it's fun. Uh, Gothi's player drew me as a bard, because she was drawing us as what our D&D classes would be. Uh, and she gave me, like, a guitar. And honestly, I, I wasn't c even considering playing piano at that point, and she fucking nailed it. Here. Let's see if I can uh, show you guys. I'm sure I have the illustration on my desk. Uh, because the tape wore off and I wasn't able to put it on my, uh, wall. Here. Careful not to knock that down. Yeah, there it is. Uh, come on. There we go. Yeah, so, uh, that's Gothi's player drawing me as a bard. Go. Gothi's player also drew me as a uh, Pokemon trainer with my boy Wartortle. Please chill. I'm, I'm going to use my instant kill attack on you. And that didn't work. Okay. I'm going to use normal fighting techniques against you. There we go. I'm thinking of commissioning a piece of, like, me as Soul Bad Guy for the Guilty Gear cover album. But I'm gonna wait until I get my new microphone and start recording the songs for it before I consider commissioning it. Because I can probably draw it myself, but if I'm gonna be busy recording, then I think I might skip that step and put uh, give it to someone else. I think I can catch you, yeah? You're on easy mode. We prefer not to be in this corner. Being completely honest here. Oh, was it... Yeah, because the punch fireball didn't do anything. Backwards kick was that. Forwards kick was that. Was it Slash that did the projectile? Yeah, it was. Okay. I've been doing it wrong the, in, uh, this entire time.
damn straight I win. So the Kingdom of Zep has that uh, philosophy where they don't invade people, they just beat you up and leave to prove a point. <laughs> ことは、<笑> なる事業調査というわけではなさそうだ。オーファスは人々の知り得ない危険性を秘めています。そのことを立証し、聖王様に上申する。そのためにも第三者である被告の科学的検知が必要なのです。つまり、元老院の起こした事件はまだ終わっ
Oh, apparently as of the next game, he's gonna be a former king. Oh, geez, there's more. Okay, uh, let's, let's kick Chip's ass. Ah, the evidence. We'll have to, uh, present that to Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. Uh, so if you don't remember the last game, uh, the Opus units were like these robots that end up turning against everyone when the Conclave activated their plans. Essentially, like, Gears can be manipulated by Justice, the giant Evangelion unit thing. And when the Conclave brought over Justice, because the Robots had gear cells, they could just control them. Chip? What are you doing? Ah uh, yes, Chip Zenoff being a fucking idiot. I mean, that's actually a good point. I'm gonna kick your ass, but I'm gonna do so while thinking about what you said. Okay, well, I, I whiffed that completely. I'm still gonna kick your ass, Chip, though. Oh, I did not block that properly. Okay, now I gotta stop getting fancy. There we go. And to add insult to injury. That, that was pretty damn serious. You didn't. You could have just asked. Dude, you literally had all last game to see the strength of my resolve. Human, huh? God, these animations are so much better than Sign. They really stepped up their budget. Alright, this uh, theme is called NSFW. Should have tagged my stream with that, I guess. Yeah, 
But hey, now we have context for uh, that scene in story mode where Kai picked up the, the kunai. God, I I wish that I could have the skill set that Daisuke Ishiwatari has. Like, holy shit. What a person to aspire to be, you know? One thing I may have neglected to mention, I, I might have earlier in the stream, but uh, this is my first time playing through the Revelator story. I've heard bits and pieces of what happens, but I haven't like actually gone through the whole story. So I'm like, as new to this as any of you guys would be. And I, I do have to beat this before playing Strive, because Strive takes place after this game, so... Man, Break a Spell is also a really, really good one. I want to, like, collect all the CDs for, uh, the vocal tracks in Guilty Gear. I don't think, uh, like, OG Guilty Gear all the way through to, uh, XX actually had vocal tracks, aside from a specific version of the Midnight Carnival. Uh, so it would only be from, like, X Art Sign to Strive. And Strive is fucking killing it with the vocal tracks. Like, you you make a rock and roll fighting game and make such a rock and roll soundtrack for it that you gotta just keep it up. Every, every new game is like a new album. It's great. Alright, we should have got, like, 2,000 world dollars at least from that. So we should have enough for a 10-pull from the, uh, gotcha. Man, I was way better with Elfelt. Yep, we have enough for one more 10-pull. So let's go fishing. Fishing for stuff. Cool. All right, we got Johnny, we got an icon. Ooh. For Accent Core Plus R, Saul Bad Guy, which I'm going to use, absolutely. Uh, a fresh crawfish. Nothing for uh, our figure, though. Like, all, all we got is Leo. Leo and Default. I don't think we've unlocked any plates. Yeah. There we go. But...
we're not going to be doing a uh, another episode of story mode this late. It's uh, it's about time we stopped. Uh, I mean, thank you for joining me for the first episode of Revelator. I'm I'm really excited for more, and we are going to beat it before Strive comes out, 100. percent Uh. I'm hoping that maybe we can beat it within four streams, and then we can do, like, two of, uh, you know, Accent Core plus R, but we'll see. I, I don't want to rush. Uh, I guess on the docket, we're going back to Pokemon Yellow on, uh, Saturday for the, uh, Saturday Retro stream. But, I'm gonna make a Twitter poll to see if maybe people would prefer I go back to Pokemon Snap, despite the fact that I've made more progress off the stream. And, uh, hey, if you guys want to, then I will 100% go back to it. Uh, and of course, Kamen Rider in the evening. I think we're gonna be able to finish it. And then I'll have to figure out what to play on Saturday nights. <laughs> I... You know, there, there's a chance that I could go into, like, Climax Fighters or, uh, Batch Ride War Genesis, but... I kinda wanna move on and make Saturday nights, uh, just something quick that I can finish before June when I replace it with Final Fantasy VII Integrate. Um, but hey, until then, I'll catch you guys later! <laughs>